Hey guys, today I wanted to talk about my recent trip to Austin, Texas, the capital city of Texas, and I spent a few years there. I went there for one of my best friend's bachelor party, and it's not it wasn't a typical bachelor party how it sounds like, you know, all this crazy partying. It was more like a honestly like a gathering like old times because we all used to hang out all the time and he now lives in Philly, so it was just a good chance for all of us to catch up and honestly, it was a lot of fun. So from here to Houston, oh sorry, from Houston to Austin is roughly a little more than two hours, two and a half if it like with traffic and honestly, there's nothing much to see on the road except flat farmland and I used to really enjoy making this drive it's just very peaceful I get a lot of time to myself just to listen to music listen to some podcasts I drove with some friends and it was a quick breeze so for this trip we really wanted to hit the lake up so we did grab an Airbnb that fit like seven of us on the lake and it was perfect we the first day we got there we played some pool we, we didn't hit the lake the first day because it was kind of um, later in the day, but we did enjoy the amenities that this place had. It had like a pool table, um, some cornhole, and yeah, we kind of just caught up, drank some brews, and it was honestly like old times. I miss, I feel like especially the older we get, and it's such a cliche but true thing, you have to enjoy moments like these. I know when you're younger, it's uh, you always think these times will last and they do, but they're just not as frequent. So I always cherish moments like these where I get to hang out with my friends. And that kind of brings me to why I, I think the core purpose of why I love taking photos is at the end of the day, that's all we have, pictures, memories, and that's like a big, big part of why I enjoy taking photos. So the next day we did rent a boat on the lake. Um, it's called Lake Travis for those of you who aren't familiar with the Austin area. This was my first time doing like tubing that's attached to a boat and also wakeboarding. It's like surfing where you're holding onto a rope and the boat is pulling you and my goodness, that was really hard. I didn't really get a chance to actually to the surfing it was actually way harder than I thought I'm not gonna lie to you I thought it'd be well I didn't think it'd be easy but I thought I'd, I'd at least get a few seconds where I'm actually like going but no that never happened but the tubing part was really fun and I feel like it was the perfect day for it there was a little bit of clouds so it wasn't too sunny but also no rain or anything like that so we definitely lucked out and we spent four hours on the lake, which at first I thought that would be a too much time, but I think it was a good amount. We definitely made the most of it. Yeah, our friend definitely had a lot of fun. It was actually his first time on the lake, like doing boat stuff. So I'm really happy for him and um, yeah. <music>
so of course the next day we couldn't leave the city without getting some barbecue and as many choices as there are in the city we decided to go with this place called Leroy and Lewis barbecue I've never heard of this place but my friend he's the one who heard of it from the show called somebody feed Phil it's like a travel eating show on Netflix it's pretty popular I've heard of the show I just haven't seen that episode where he went and it was like a little um, food truck and it was it was good I, I didn't really expect anything less than that so yeah I'm glad we went there I got some beef cheeks which were my first time trying that and they're actually really delicious it was very tender well cooked and I had to get my favorite which is moist briskets So today I kind of wanted to do like a, a vlog style video, but more so like a photo log, kind of just explaining my trip, just kind of the, the fun I had in Austin. I appreciate you guys watching. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. I release a video every single week. I've never missed a week. So please continue to support this channel. And if you can give this video a thumbs up because it really does help my videos get out there for more people to see. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.